morning and it took me from 8 in the morning to 1 something and then I had to check emails respond to some brands because you guys know I haven't really been doing any sponsorship content honestly I have been winging all of my videos since late 2023 usually um, I write down the con my content I know exactly what I'm doing in my videos these last videos from late 2023 probably November on winging it real life whatever happens in my life that's what you guys see and it seemed like you guys like those videos better than the ones that's like strategically planned out so hey we just winging it over here so anyway this today is like i said it's like five something i gotta get ready to cook for the kids but i have to take down this easter stuff y'all because it needs to go so we're about to do that and then we're gonna go down the basement and figure out what stuff I'm gonna put up. So I don't wanna put up any bright colors cause I have like the coral color, but I'm gonna put that up in May. So what I'm gonna put up here is, I have this green wreath and I have these black and cream pillows and black and cream rug. And then I have these two black planters with like little trees. I'm gonna put them outside and then a, a nice green wreath. And that will be for April. And then the middle of May or early May, probably once I come back from my Disney trip, um, we can do spring. And then June, of course, we come out with the summer stuff. So that's what we're about to do. Y'all know Penny's waiting to go outside. Where's she at? Good girl, mama. She was on the chair. She wanna go outside. She like, mom. I want to go outside. You want to go outside? Let's go outside, mama. Look at her. She's so excited. Come on, let's go outside. Oh, my goodness. Did this break? Oh. Oh. It, the wind knocked my darn bunny down. Oh, no. I'm going to have to glue this back. I love this little bunny. Okay, well, that's that. away they had not came back <laughs> all right okay 
So what we're gonna do, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, I gotta buy some Gorilla Glue. All right, so these are the little things I'm talking about. I gotta make sure no creatures are in here. I'm gonna put these outside. I haven't used these in like a long time. Ooh, make sure nothing is in it. And then we're gonna put out this. You know? I need to spray paint these black. Ooh! I should spray, we gonna spray paint these back. Now the problem is, <laughs> I gotta find some spray paint. Oh man, where that spray paint at? Let me go put these, put these outside today. Oh man, I wanna spray paint that black. Where is, I swear. I do have no clue where that spray paint at. I don't know. And then I can do this. Let me put this back. Baby. find it it's gonna be looking like that see I want to spray paint this black but I might can't find it so hold on we're gonna do a little DIY shall we <laughs> one All right, I am done outside. I'm about to cook. 
I'm just gonna throw some chicken in the air fryer, um, make some macaroni and cheese, the Velveeta kind, and some Brussels sprouts for dinner. And then I'm gonna run to the grocery store because the kids have nothing for school this week. Plus I told you guys with the solar eclipse coming, I didn't even get no glasses. And my neighbor just said, oh, I got 10 pair of glasses on my front porch, y'all can have them for grabs. But I'm not a person that's always near my phone. I don't constantly have my phone with me. When I'm home, my phone be all over the house. So if my friends or family ever text me and I take forever, just know it's not intentionally. <laughs> Cause sometimes the phone is upstairs, downstairs. I'm never a person that's attached to my phone. So too late, a couple of my neighbors took the glasses. So there's no more glasses. So I guess we won't be looking at the solar eclipse, but I'm sure I'll go on TikTok. And um, I'll be able to go on TikTok and see what the solar eclipse, you know. I'm sure people are gonna record it. But yeah, so let me cook real quick and I'll pick up in a little bit. Good morning guys. I'm up and I'm at the market. We are about to do a little bit of shopping this morning. And then I have to go to a dentist appointment to get my teeth cleaned. So yeah, um, I just wanted to start, you know, open up today's vlog. So yeah, let's shop, shall we? some maz I want some fresh mozzarella cheese I'm gonna make chicken parm one of these nights y'all know my family love chicken parm but I don't know what's a good brand maybe this is a good brand thin slice <laughs> All right, I am back from the store. I'm about to hurry up, put the groceries up real quick, and then run to the, den the dentist. But I need to write down my list, not my list, I need to write down my menu of what I'm cooking this week so I can stay focused, y'all, because these last couple weeks, I swear, I've been winging dinner and everything else. Um, today is Monday. So let me know if you guys are going to watch the solar eclipse. Uh, I didn't get no glasses, so I guess I'm not watching anything. But also, um, what was I about to tell you guys? I forgot what I was about to tell you. Dang, I was about to tell y'all something. Forgot. I gotta hurry up. Penny's crying in here. Oh, when I come back from the dentist, I have to stop at Costco's and I need to go to Walmart because I need to get some cleaning stuff. Um, I need to go to Costco's to get like just a couple things like grapes, strawberries, because I buy them in bulk, apples. They have, uh, I didn't buy this fruit tray, but they have like, you know, some stuff there that I want to get. Um... I'm excited to make the chicken parm and try this mozzarella cheese. I'm excited. Okay. And then off to the gym I go after that. I'm thinking, I don't know if I want to do my room with mint green this year. I kind of think I want to just keep it cream. I don't know. 
don't know what y'all think. Comment down below. Let me know. <laughs> let me know what y'all think. This little bit of food was two hundred dollars. Like, I don't be understanding why food is so expensive. Two hundred and seven dollars I spent. For what? Nothing. Separate this chicken. Penny! Penny freaking out because nobody here. She was here by herself. Okay. So let's write our calendar. Let's write what we're going to cook this week. Now I remember why I haven't been writing on this. Because the kids lost all my little markers. So when I go to Walmart, when I come back, I'm going to go ahead and buy some more. But I'm going to write down everything so I don't forget. Because the age that I'm at, I forget everything. <sighs> okay. So... For Monday, we're going to make, so Monday, which is today, I'm going to do, I'm going to make the kids some chicken and rice, but I'm going to make the adults some sauteed shrimp over the rice with some broccoli. So today is chicken plus shrimp over rice and broccoli. Okay, and then Tuesday, Tuesday, we can, we're going to have chicken parm, chicken parm. Wednesday, I won't be here, so my mom is going to cook for the kids and my husband. I will be in New York. You guys won't see that on this vlog. You'll see that on the next vlog. Um, me and my girlfriend, Vanessa, we're going to New York to celebrate our birthdays um and uh we're doing a whole day in new york so we're going to some museums we're going to go eat at my favorite store rh we're going to rh rooftop in new york and then go do some shopping and stuff like that so that's wednesday but my mom can make some steak steak and mac and cheese with some asparagus if she want. Thursday. What's Thursday? Well, I'm making Thursday. See, I done forgot already. Damn, what's Thursday? I don't know what we're making on Thursday. We can have burgers and fries. I just gotta buy some burgers. And then Friday, we're going to do fish. And then Saturday, I ordered the kids some pizza because me and my husband are going to another restaurant on Saturday. So I ordered the kids some pizza. And that's it. So this is my menu for the week. I'll keep this here so that way, once I get back home, I can just write it out on the calendar because I will forget. Um, yeah, I'm about to put this food up and then I'll just see you guys when I get back from the dentist. We just relaxed for a couple minutes and Cindy will be in to get the whole point off. All right, thank you. My mouth hurt from my cleaning. Too rough. We made it home in time. We are going to see the solar eclipse thanks to my neighbors. I was able to pick up four pair of glasses, which is fine because Sam is at work. And it's only me, Mahila, Cairo, and my mom is here. My husband's at work. So we only needed four pairs. So 3.23, we're supposed to see it. Penny is acting up. Penny want to come outside so bad with us. Oh, 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 well, we that's right. It's right again. <laughs> my eyes so bad. I got to do this. <laughs> and then off to Cairo school for a conference. Hope you guys have a good day. See you when I get back. 
Good morning. I just picked up my man clothes from the cleaners. And now I'm about to go to Cairo conference. So wish me luck. And then I have to take my highlight to, I know you guys can't see me because of the sun. But then I have to take my highlight to her urgent care appointment because she doesn't feel good. real life mom life right now mom and wife life that's what's going on right now um so yeah that's basically what i'm doing today also i have to go to the dentist i have to be there at two remember i told you guys they have to put a crown on my tooth also i have a hair wax appointment at milan hazer hair laser removal Have you ever heard of that place Anyway, I'm going there for my underarms, my wuha, and my facial hair because y'all, ever since I had my Highland Cairo, I've been getting these chin hairs. I know y'all can probably see them sometimes on the videos, but it is what it is. You know, like, I'm so confident with myself. I don't, I don't worry about stuff like that because, first of all, a lot of women go through it. And secondly, it is what it is. I can't do nothing about it. So, um, I'm going to finally check them out. Y'all know I'm scared. I'm so scared of getting hair laser removal, but I'm tired of getting wax. I am so tired of getting my underarms and my Brazilian wax. It hurts so bad. So I'm really thinking I'm going to just take the step and do hair laser removal and then also get my face done too. So, um, so that way I ain't got to worry about no ugly behind chin hairs. Okay. Hold on y'all. Let me, I hope my highlight don't have strep throat because she keeps saying her throat hurt so we shall see guys i'll keep you updated back i just had the conference meeting with Cairo teacher um all i can say is Cairo is definitely a boy all boy sorry i took i just got in the car and pulled off but um so basically, Cairo wants to be a class clown. Mm -hmm. My whole years of being a mom for almost 19 years, I never went through this. I never went through this. My girls, I didn't have any issues. So far, Mahila is like perfect in school. She's so scary. However, today, um... It was a little disturbing, might I say. And I'm just being honest because this is a transparent moment because I know a lot of you guys might have boys. But I notice a difference in Cairo behavior because his little attitude, like he just like bro this, bro that. He think he Mr. Cool Guy. And I'm like, where did this new little new attitude come from? Well, come to find out, there are kids in his classroom, new kids that Cairo is starting to hang out with, and they're rubbing off on Cairo. So my job as a parent is I need to tell my child there's nothing wrong with hanging with these kids. You know, if they're your friends and you like them, that's cool. But there's a time and a place where you play. There's a time and a place where you can make funny faces and doing all that. Like you can't do that in school, Cairo. Especially if your teacher is sitting here trying to teach. So I'm gonna have a little talk with his little butt when he get when he get back home from school. Because this is unacceptable. Like I'm I'm really upset. I really am. Because I'm telling you, when I tell you and I tell you, I know y'all only get like 30, 45 minutes of my life that I share with you all. Oh, so much more goes on in my life that you guys don't see. Sometimes I don't even know how I balance it all. Seriously. But I think that's just my personality. I'm a determined person and I don't let nothing defeat me. But sometimes it's hard. It's hard wearing so many hats. It's hard being a mom. It's hard being a wife. It's hard trying to run a business it's hard you know trying to work a nine to five still work a nine to five and balance all these things but i just want to say it can be done because i'm doing it and there are so many other women that's doing it but just know it's not easy so if you want to do all these things 
just know it's something that it's not easy at all but anyway let me um i gotta drop because i went from the cleaners straight to cairo conference so i gotta drop my husband clothes off and then i'm gonna take my highlighter urgent care real quick and then hopefully i'll be back for my hair laser removal appointment or i'm gonna have to cancel that so we'll see an hour later we're still sitting in the waiting room So I don't think I'm going to my appointment today. Y'all see my gray hair? Sometimes it comes back, um, my throat starts to hurt. But that's on and off? Yeah. When you cough, do you bring up anything? Like any mucus? Not really. I don't see my highness said, how is this little girl bald headed but got pigtails coming out of the side of her hair? <laughs> so funny. The, um, all this testing was negative. Oh, good. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> so what symptoms are you having? Um, the stuffy nose oh. and I cough. And sometimes my throat starts to hurt. And I also can't taste the smell. Interesting. Okay, when did it start? Um, Saturday. Saturday? Okay. Um... Are you eating? Sam was in the car the whole time. <laughs> Bro, literally, my lash came off. No way. <laughs> so, Mahila doesn't have strep or COVID, but she do have <laughs> some type of virus. They say there's a lot of viruses going around. What you want? Breakfast. Always gonna spend money. The walk was great. Um, I'm about to go to the dentist. I stopped at my mom's house. I want, oh, let me show you guys my high school picture. Hold on. I look so mean. <laughs> look how mean I look. So mean. And this is when Samaya graduated from eighth grade. This and then look at this picture. So mean. <laughs> I was so mean when I was young. So mean. So anyway, once I get to the dentist, um, all they gotta do is put a seal on my tooth, and then that's it. And then I'm gonna go home and cook. I think I wanna do. I wanna make some shrimp and rice and broccoli, and I'll make the kids some chicken. Here we go. I make some chicken, rice, and broccoli for the kids. Oh, hang in there. That's all we can do? Can and I tell y'all, I'm so tired of being at the dentist. I'm tired. I'm over it. Pray for me, y'all. They said I got to get a post crown. They got to drill in my am. tooth. We're recording? <laughs> This is recording your experience. I'm recording the experience. You'll be you want to say hi? You'll be fine. <laughs> I'm scared. Help me, please. <laughs> if anybody listening to this, if I'm not here, you're fine. <laughs> All right, I am back home from the dentist. You know what's crazy? Yesterday when I went for my cleaning, all the ladies said was, oh, when you come back, they're just going to seal your tooth, you know, just seal it off. I had a darn near procedure. He had to drill inside my tooth, take something out, put something back in. Then he had to build my tooth up or something. Y'all, I was freaking out. I was freaking out. And then I have a crown, what, like probably a couple years ago, this tooth cracked over here. So they had put a crown. Y'all, why when he was flossing, like he was like, let me just check on this crown. Why when he floss my tooth, it popped out. So he's like, oh, you know what? You need a new crown for this one. So then he had to, I had to get a, like they had to put that foam in your mouth to shake your tooth or whatever. So for the new crown, at this point, I don't want to see the dentist no more. I am done with the dentist. Done, 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 done. 
Okay. Anyway, I'm about to cook dinner. I'm making some rice, chicken, and shrimp. I told you guys that already and some broccoli. So I'm about to cook real quick. I'm gonna take the kids to read this. It's so beautiful out. It is so nice. And then um, I finally went to Walmart and got some little Sharpies that I, I told you guys in the last vlog. I need to write down my menu. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. I'm gonna show you guys what I'm cooking for the week. So we're gonna do that together. And then I'm going to, after I'm done cooking, I'm gonna go ahead and head to the gym. So, that's what we're about to do. All right, y'all, the shrimps are done. The broccoli is cooking. The rice is done. And, oops, this is done. Chicken and gravy for the kids over the rice. All right, so I'm about to make everybody plate and then I'm going to, oh, then I'm going to the gym and I have to take Cairo to Taekwondo. So I'm gonna drop Cairo off at Taekwondo and then I'm going to the gym, so. And then I'll come back after the kids eat. We'll go to Rita's for dessert. Workout was great. I picked Cairo up. Um, we ate dinner. Now we are about to go get some Rita's. And then I'm going to drop Cairo off with the Rita's for everybody in the house. And then I am going to TJ Maxx in Party City. Tomorrow is my friend Vanessa birthday. Um, and we're going to New York. So the next vlog will be a spend the day with me in NYC. Um, we're going to eat at RH Rooftop because y'all know it's my favorite place. But we're really celebrating both of our birthdays tomorrow. Her birthday is tomorrow, but we're going to celebrate my birthday and her birthday. Um, so we're going to go to a couple museums. We're going to go shopping. We're going to go out to eat. So I have to run to TJ Maxx because I want to make her like a cute little basket. Because you know, y'all know she just had a baby. So I just want to make her like some cute stuff, like little mommy stuff, as far as like facial stuff, pajamas, um, little skincare stuff, and then I'm gonna go get her some balloons. So yeah, that's what we're about to do, and then I'm probably gonna go ahead and close out the vlog after this. Yeah. I'm just making it, they're about to close. It's like 7.45 right now. Yeah, I'm gonna get some balloons blown up. Um, yo, what y'all think about this? They got some that's already blew up. This is cute. Say it again. Oh, really? Oh, okay. I think I'm gonna get this one for her. This is so cute. All right, y'all, I'm back from the store. Quickly show you guys what I purchased. And I'm about to make her bed, her bed, bed. That's, that's how you know I'm tired. I'm about to make the bag and then I'm going to sleep. Well, actually, I gotta edit this video so I can post for you guys tomorrow. Um, so yeah. Hi, friend, come here. Come here, little friend. You miss your mom, and you think you get it. I miss you too. I miss you too. All right, so I got her this heatless curl set. I got that, and then I did like a like mommy little spa, I guess. Um, I got this little what's it called? Loof, loof, loofa, and then for your back. And then I got two sets of PJs. So I got these little cute short for the summertime, thin material. And this is the shirt that I got her. And then I got this pretty blue color. 
like a pretty blue and pink. And this, these little shorts. All right, so. That. And then I got these little ice cube rolls thing. Like you put water in it and then it creates a rolled ice. She likes stuff like that. And then I got this cute little. Um, let me just show you guys real quick. You'll see it got these little embezzlements on it. Embellishments. I said embezzlements. Oh my goodness. But it's so cute. So cute. So I got that. And then I got her um, exfoliating gloves. This is the bag that I'm gonna put everything in. This bag. And then I got these little paper. What are these called? Throwaway party, make and craft. Oh, uh, sheets, I don't know, paper sheets. And then this is the card, it's so cute. I know I love color. But this is the card. And then <clears throat> I got I got her a candle. I'll show you guys real quick. Oh no, wait, this is a cup. I got her this cup. Her daughter name is Gianna. Um, but she called her Gigi and this cup says Gigi on it. So I figured like this is something like sentimental That you know, she can pass down to her daughter because it has her daughter name on it But yeah, I thought this was really cute um, And then I just got her like little face stuff so like ice cubes for her face um, This smells so good if y'all see this at TJ Maxx smell it when I tell y'all it smells so good this smells really good. Um, and then that's it. Oh, and then I just got her some lashes and an Anastasia lipstick. And that's it. So I'm about to put it in the bag, put her balloon side on the table so that way I don't forget it in the morning. And that's really it. Where's the I got her a candle. I'm guessing. Don't tell me. I let me look on this receipt. I bought the damn candle, and the lady didn't. Hyla, are you? I'm gonna check on Hyla. She keep coughing. I belong, I belong to you.